think it's fair to say that the my team game mode is officially in its end game by that i mean the releasing basically everything the game's reaching the end state of its life cycle obviously nba 2k20 coming to an end call it the end game because everything's basically being thrown at us at once now i don't want this video to come off as a negative video i'm just honestly a little confused myself about this entire situation so for you guys who didn't know nba 2k20 my team just dropped a brand new collection or set of packs and it is called out of position packs now basically what this allows it allows for players to play out of their position they have dropped players like this before they've dropped a point guard Giannis they've dropped a point guard LeBron James they've dropped a couple of out of position players already but now they're dropping specific out of position players players in a pack so therefore the pack you open you have the opportunity to pull out of position players and some of the players in these packs are absolutely insane you have galaxy opal lebron james at point guard you have galaxy opal don maker who can play point guard you have dennis rodman who can play shooting guard and then you have like some troll cards you have russell westbrook who can play center spud webb who can play center it's it's very very interesting but the thing i'm confused about is like i said i'm not i'm not necessarily hating on this because obviously 2k has given my team so much free content over the past couple of days i can't even really get mad at this because they have given people the opportunity to get really good cards by simply just playing the game even though it does take a fairly long time there's really not much to complain about because they are giving us free content and now they're giving us content that you can pay for if you want and buy through packs so i'm not necessarily really angry at this because i understand that they gave us a bunch of free stuff and obviously they're going to want to make money although i don't agree with this necessarily because when 2k20 came out there was an article there was something that was said about them not dropping or them not allowing players to play out of their position yet they're literally dropping a pack collection that allows for players to play out of position like the point guard lebron i can understand that sure point guard lebron no problem with that but you have thon maker at point guard you have spud webb playing center russell westbrook playing center i mean i guess i could understand the russell westbrook part but my question is what was the point of them adding position locks was the point of them adding position locks was so f so for them to be able to drop a a collection like this for them to be able to drop a pack theme of out of position and therefore them make more money on the fact that they added in something that was apparently supposed to make the game better and make the game mode more enjoyable because last year in nba 2k19 everyone ran like four or five power forwards everyone was just running tall players at every single position so they saw that they added a position lock and said position locks are coming to nba 2k20 nba 2k20 is now out it's been out for a while and now we're getting out of position packs i just i need someone in the comment section to just clarify this for me i don't really understand what's going on i'm not a crazy my team guy i don't really follow my team insanely close i'm just confused what exactly is going on in terms of my team is this something that is normal is this something that you guys are like okay with i mean the content's dope the cards look extremely good the card art looks absolutely insane and the cards themselves look good they're really good cards but i just don't understand what the point of position locking was i don't understand what what was the point i'm i'm honestly just generally confused was this just another lie or something like i don't know maybe i'm missing something maybe you guys can clarify it a little bit for me in the comment section below but anyways i wanted to bring you guys the uh the interesting topic of the 2k community the my team community especially so i hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure to drop a like make sure to subscribe to the channel and someone please clarify it for me what the point of position locks was then but anyways see you guys next time peace